Hey guys, we've got the Final Fantasy VIII Renoa event on the global server, along with the Knights of Grandshout. Um, in this video, I'm just going to be going for a quick, simple OTK style setup on the Ancient Dinosaur. Uh, three turns or less, four units or less, and no KOs. Overall, this one's a pretty simple fight regardless. Um, it uses physical damage and damage over time, so if you can't OTK it, you might want, you might want like an evasion, provoker, physical tank or something. Uh, it's a dragon, weak to fire and darkness, but overall this one is not super super bulky or anything. It's not like, you know, most of the EX stages where you kind of need a sort of sort of a real strategy. This one is just, you know, take something and OTK it or whatever. So we're going to do dragon killer, fire imbue, and then a stat buff with Roberta, Cacteria, or we'll just cactus break. Um, big defense break and fist in peril. Runda will support chain with bolting and will just frenzy with carton. And I'm assuming this is going to be the end of the boss. If it's not, well, I guess we'll adjust, but um, yeah, I mean, you know, carton, whatever. Uh, so, okay, so now I'm going to be doing a few uh, free pulls for um, well, the weekly free stuff and all that. Uh, as far as like Knights of Grand Shelt you know, actually pulling for them, like step up and all. Um, I don't think I'm going to today, maybe this weekend or something, I'll think about it. But uh, I'm not in any big rush to get them. The banner lasts for five weeks, so there's really no rush to like immediately jump into it today, because it's, it's not like we have like a trial or something to beat. Um, there's really no content this week other than like farming for Mog events and Chronicle Battle farming. So it's like whatever, you know, no big rush here. But I do have some tickets and I'm gonna use them in the, ban in the video. So, if you don't like ticket pulls, um, this is not for you, so, you know, peace out at this point. Uh, but I'll be going and doing that. Uh, yeah, I don't want to claim that here. Okay, um, so actually, I already did the free weekly poll when I first logged in. Um, I figured, I, you know, I kind of thought after, oh, I probably should have recorded it. It wasn't anything special. It was five rainbows. They were all complete worthless, so whatever. You know, big sad. Um, so, we've got this. I'll do these. We'll see what happens. Um, you know, Knight's Grand Shell would be nice and all. Grab him. I do kind of want one copy at the very minimum. Just so that he's available for the Shard Dungeon when it eventually rolls around again. Um, Knight's Grand Shell did get buffed on Global. He's now got a... Uh, let's lock him. He's now got a 420 baseline modifier. 400 in, on his LB. 450 with um, Typhus of Spirit. Which is pretty nice. Uh, it is still locked to light element, which is, you know, not the greatest. So, you know, good unit. The card's obviously amazing still. That requires EX3, so that's a really, really heavy investment. Uh, so, okay, so these pulls didn't really do anything for me. But we're not done yet. We've got some rainbow pulls for guaranteed rainbow. And we've got a guaranteed Neo as well, and then a few regular tickets. So, we'll see what happens. I have been using all my regular tickets on the Dark Rain banner and trying to get a second copy for his um, another one of his STMRs. Hasn't worked out yet. Um, I did get one, uh, let's see, these are all worthless. I did get one uh, Neo off, off last week from doing tickets on Dark Rain banner, but it was uh, Melia. Yeah, big sad face on Melia. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and use some tickets for Knight's Grand Show. Uh, Oh yeah, the the amazing fusion LB. Let's watch it. Why not? There's not much to this video, so we may as well fill it with something. Watch the LB, and of course, I am kind of talking over him, but he's speaking Japanese anyway, which I assume most people watching this video can't understand anyway, myself included. Um, so we got six tickets. Let's see what happens. Uh, we get 30 login shards, 50 VIP shards. So, 50 VIP, 30. Oh yeah, that's 70 away from EX2, so that's pretty far. Without the Shard Dungeon. The Shard, dun the char shard Dungeon just came around as well, so it'll be a while till we get another one, which feels bad. The next one will probably be after the anniversary. And I assume there's going to be some, like new flashiness coming on the anniversary that I'd probably, gonna, I'd probably rather run in the Shard Dungeon anyway. But you never know, that's, that's you know, three months away. Or two to three months away. Then again, the global anniversary 
was like dragged out across half the year. So maybe it's like eight months away until the end of the anniversary. <laughs> That's, that's how they that's how they do it on global. Uh, so we've got two more tickets. Not looking promising yet, but we do have the whole Mog King to farm, so that gives a bunch of tickets. Um, that I'll be probably tossing all those tickets onto the Knights of Grand Show banner while it's up. It's gonna be up for like five weeks, so like I said, there's really no rush to like jump into it immediately on day one. Because there's nothing to use them on. Well, that didn't happen. We do still have a guaranteed Neo, so we'll be using that right now, and I guess I'll get my... What Neo are we going to get from the guaranteed? I'm going to call something old and ancient and bad. Let's say... The original Aerith. Yeah, the last one of these I got was like Axtar or something. It was something completely and utterly troll. So... But, I'm hopeful, you know? I'd love something good, like an Esther. <laughs> I mean, it's a brand new unit. Literally came out today. Uh, man, of, of, of the two units that came out today, why couldn't it be the other one? But I mean, okay, Renoa and Angela, sure, why not? It's um, a brand new unit. And really, I mean, to say this is going to trigger her fans, but she's not super special as far as like the actual unit herself her main her main main bonus is the field and her field is totally usable at ex0 so is it though isn't her is her field in both forms or is her field only in the shift form you know i don't actually know but whichever way it goes um that's ex1 after the vip the vip shop so that's that's ex1 Renault and angelo okay okay i'll take it um, you know, if I'm going to get a new unit, the one that came out today is great. And hey, Sephiroth loves that field. And I love me some Sephiroth, so there we go. Uh, pretty nice, pretty nice. Anyway, yeah, so for today, that's that's the end of today. Um, polls. Uh, I will consider Knights of Grand Shelt for the next few days, and maybe I'll go for it this weekend or something, but... I'm definitely not making like a jump decision right away because I mean if, even if I did pull for him right now immediately there's literally nowhere to use him like I could bring him the Clash of Wills but I already capped Clash I already capped Clash of Wills so whatever anyway hope you guys have good luck and hopefully your um your guaranteed Neo today is something current and not something ancient see you next time.